All right, welcome back to TV5 News at 9, everyone. We are back with another edition of Ask the Sheriff. And today we have Gladwin County Sheriff Michael Shea in here in the studio. How are you? Very good. How are you? I'm doing great. Thanks good. for coming in. It's good to see you. Uh, so today we are talking about your office, the sheriff's office, and we hear about it all the time. But uh, can you tell us, in case we don't know at home, some of the differences between maybe Michigan State Police or like city police? and how that compares to sheriffs. Yeah, the Office of Sheriff uh, is constitutionally charged, and it's actually mentioned in the Michigan Constitution, uh, and cities, townships, state police, they're all uh, derived by statutory law from the Michigan legislature. No way, okay, so that is something I say that we learn something new every single day, and I just learned that, so thank you for uh, explaining. Yeah. What are some major differences between the sheriff's office and these other law agencies? I think one of the first things that people notice is we operate and maintain county jails, uh, but some of our responsibilities are different from the other law enforcement uh, as it relates to uh, the services that we provide to Michigan courts, uh, executions on property, um, uh, 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 evictions, mm. some of those things. And then one of the other thing that the public sees a lot is our Marine Patrol Division out on our waterways. Very good. And what would you say um, is, I guess, most rewarding for you working in the Sheriff's Office? Um, the public trust, mainly. Mm. Um, it, when you're out there, you know, when, when uh, doing the job always has to be more important than having the job. Yeah. And, and the people that you serve know that. As soon as you get that, that trust and relationship and rapport built, the rest is all, it's all elementary. Very good. And I know that we put a lot of trust into our local law enforcement. So can you just tell our viewers how long you've been in law enforcement and specifically the Gladwin County Sheriff? Um, I've been in law enforcement starting uh, 35 years soon. And I'll be starting my 21st year as the County Sheriff uh, as of October 8th. Congratulations. Thank you. We're certainly you. glad you're here. <laughs> Thanks. I appreciate it. Um, I know that a lot of offices and agencies work together. Can you tell us how you specifically work with maybe other sheriffs in our region? All of our Gladwin County neighbors, Midland Counties, uh, Saginaw County, uh, Bill down here, yeah. Isabella, Claire, Aranac, Ogemaw, Roscommon. We all share resources. We all share training. We all, uh, we all get along really great as it relates to the overall connection between the counties, and then the Michigan Sheriff's Association, which take care of all Michigan counties, really helps us out for training needs and those kind of things. And I'm sure that lots of us are very appreciative that you guys kind of had that tight-knit yeah. uh, com community to help us. Yeah. Uh, since you've been elected, I guess, what would you say, how does it feel to come to work every day and take on this role of sheriff? It is a big role. Um, well, thank you. I appreciate yeah, it. Yeah. Um, good news for us is when you get the community support, and it's not just me, it's our team, our corrections department, our road folks, our 911. So they, along with me, build that community trust. Uh, you know, and it's always a privilege and an honor to represent my community, but what a great community to represent. Absolutely. Well, Sheriff, I appreciate you being here. Is there anything else you want our viewers at home to know? No, no. no uh, it, it come to Gladwin. It's a great place. I love going to Gladwin. I, I tout my trips there all the time. I used to go to Lake Lancer and Sugar Springs and, and the downtown yeah. area. Yeah. So thank you for keeping our community safe. Yeah, my pleasure. Thank Very you good. for having me. Absolutely. And if you at home have any questions for the Sheriff, please email us at WNEM at WNEM.com. You can also send it to our social media. Matthew tracks out your forecast right after the break.